Hey guys, welcome to Driving TV. In today's video, I will be teaching you guys the basic controls and function of your vehicle. So you guys feel familiar and more confident when it's time just to hit the road, do the road test, or even just take driving lessons. So make sure that you guys watch the full video. If you find it helpful, make sure to subscribe because I will be posting a lot more tutorials and also comment below because your feedback is very, very important. So hang on tight and let's dive in. First things first, let's talk about the steering wheel. This crucial component serves as your primary tool for controlling the direction of your vehicle. It's essential to maintain a firm grip on the wheel, preferably at the nine and three o'clock position, as you have seen in my other videos, to ensure maximum control and stability while you're driving. Now, attached to the steering wheel column, you'll find the stock, the stock. The multifunctional device serves various purposes. To indicate a left turn, simply push the stock down and for a right turn, you push it up. I'm going to give you a little demonstration on what this is going to look like right here. Additionally, some models do include a headlight flasher at the end of this stock. Um, so yeah, so a quick pull towards you and it will flash the headlights providing uh, a signal to other drivers. Now let's move on to the right stock. Let's discuss its role in controlling your windshield wipers. This handy feature ensures visibility in adverse weather conditions. So you can adjust the speed of the wipers to match the intensity um, and pushing the stock will dispense water fluid to effectively clean your windshield. Amazing, very easy and very handy. Now, ignition. So let's talk about starting the engine. The ignition process may vary depending on your car's make and model. Some vehicles uh, utilize a push start button, while others, like this one here, um, just requires a traditional key. Simply insert the key and turn it to the right to start the engine, just like I'm showing you here. So now it's time to familiarize yourself with the gear shift. An automatic transmission vehicle, each letter corresponds to a different gear like P for parking, R for reverse, N for neutral, and D for drive, and so forth. Understanding that is very important, as well as the pedals. So these are your primary means of controlling the speed and stopping power of your car. The accelerator pedal, also, also known as the gas pedal, increases the speed when depressed. The brake pedal, on the other hand, slows or stops the vehicle when pressed firmly. In manual transmission cars, you have to find a clutch pedal which is used to um, start the engine from the transmission to facilitate gear changes, but that's a whole different uh, ball game. Let's just focus on this right now. Um, it's very crucial that you practice uh, the pedals and get familiar with it, braking and accelerating and so forth, because practice, practice, practice is very, very important in order, in order to have proper control of your vehicle and feel confident. Um, so the gear shift, when you press your brake, you are able to then move it from parking to drive just like this, just like this. That is how you're going to um, change. So make sure that you practice that a lot. Um, moving forward to the dashboard. So now let's shift our focus here. The dashboard serves as the nerve center of your vehicle, providing vital information at a glance. It displays essential data such as your current speed, fuel level, engine revolutions, as shown uh, right here, and um, as well as the engine temperature, which it's all like uh, monitoring the health of your vehicle overall. So also, um, it's very important in order to uh, maintain and be uh, updated with the performance of your car. Now, the center console here, um, we find a lot of things. You'll find the controls and features aimed at enhancing your driving experience from climate control, settings for adjusting the temperature, fan speed to um, the radio, tuning into your favorite tunes. This console puts the power at your fingertips. You can also access um, navigation systems and adjust various vehicle settings to suit your preferences. Now let's go to headlights. I mean, the car lights, car lights. So. 
let's um, talk about where these are located. So located on either uh, on the dashboard or the stock near the steering wheel. These controls allow you to eliminate the road ahead and signal your intentions to other drivers. Understanding how to operate your headlights, turn signals and hazard lights is essential for safe driving, especially during low light conditions and um, complicated weather. So um, as I told you on the other side, you have the other stock, which is the windshield wipers and all of that that we discussed uh, previously. Now, now let's talk about uh, the seatbelt and the importance that it is. I mean, you need to have your seatbelt on. Um, it's the most important thing before you do anything else. You put your seatbelt and then the mirrors. Now, last but certainly not least, let's not overlook the importance of your of your side and rear view mirrors. Properly adjusted mirrors are your eyes on the road. So providing crucial visibility of your surroundings and helping you anticipate potential hazards. So take the time to adjust your mirrors before you set off and make sure that you have the optimal visibility and safety throughout your journey, which is very, 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 very important. To sum it all up, we have covered the essentials, control and functions of your car in this tutorial. From the steering wheel and turn signals to windshield wipers, ignition, gear shift, pedals, dashboard, center console, car lights, and mirrors, we explored each component's role in ensuring a safe and comfortable driving experience. Understanding these features is crucial for beginner drivers as they lay the foundation for safe and confident driving. So whether it's navigating through traffic or adjusting climate controls, familiarity with your car's controls enhances both safety and convenience on the road. Remember, practice makes perfect, so take time to familiarize yourself with these features before hitting the road. And if you found this video helpful, please be sure to subscribe for more informative content. We've um, been uploading weekly, if not every like other day, uh, new video tutorials. And well, guys, I mean, if you found this video uh, helpful, please leave a comment below because feedback is always appreciated. Until then, see you soon, drive safe and enjoy the journey.